Good morning, grandkids. I'm going to try to get a video made this morning. One uh, where I'm showing you all the latest gifts that I've gotten. So. This one includes some new rocks that I got. What is so cool about these is all them circles that's in the rock. That's deep in the rock because this has been polished on the surface and those circles are inside that stone. I just, I think those are so cool. And I'll tell you what they are. These have them also, but they aren't polished. And here's the card that came with the rocks. I think these 3D cards are so cute. And on the card, it says, Merry Christmas, Shirley, a, and a Happy New Year. I hope you can enjoy this card and make lots of good memories, however you plan to celebrate. I'm going to go watch another one of your Skyrim videos now, I think. Wishing all the best, Jess. This is Jess Edits. I'm always reading her comments on on my pages. I think I hear from her every day. Or him, I don't even know. Have you ever told me if you're a male or a female? I just know Jess. <laughs> I think that's female. And this is the their letter. Look they typed it so I could read it nice. Hi Shirley, this is Jess Hewitt of It's Jess Edits on YouTube. I've been wanting to write to you for what feels like years now, but today I'm finally doing it. I know this letter probably won't reach you until after Christmas, but if it's early, I hope you have a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. I also hope the font is easy to read. Oh yeah, it is. The pop-up card I sent with this note was just a cute one I thought that you might enjoy. It brought me a sense of comfort just like your videos do for all of us grandkids. Though to be completely honest, I'm my first choice was a red cardinal card, but the store only had the display one left and was completely sold out of the actual cards. So next time I plan to send you one like that. <laughs> cool, I love the red birds. I'll have to tell you about a red bird when I finish this. Also, with the card I am finally sending you, some Petoskey, or Petoskey stones. Yes, I remember you talking to me about them. I mentioned them a long time ago, maybe on Twitter, and now you can have some of your own for your own collection. Thank you so much. These rocks come mostly from Lake Superior and are supposedly fossilized coral. I always think that they look so cool and I hope you really enjoy them. I do, I really like them. The polished one is a thin stone my parents bought once, and the rougher ones are stones that I actually found personally while walking the lake shore up in Charlevoix, Michigan. So you can see what they look like when they're when cleaned, but a bit up a bit. So you can see what they're are like when they are cleaned up a bit versus found out in the wild. As far as Skyrim, I've been loving the Cooper Cold Hand series so far, and I'm also enjoying Browd the Blade. Oh, you've gone back and started watching Browd the Blade. Since I've been working my way through that 
playlist. You give my you give me something fun to look forward to each morning as I get ready to face the day, and I am always excited to see what you do next. Praying for a holiday season of good memories with family and friends, good food, maybe a little chocolate too. <laughs> I hope you know how much we all treasure you in this wonderful online community. I hope someday I can drive down to visit too since you're fairly close after all. Oh, I, I would enjoy that very much. I love it when people come to visit me. And I would really love to meet you, Jess. Sending lots of love, Jess. Thank you so much. There is several people uh, come to visit me and, and uh, it, it's always so much fun and, and there's always stuff to talk about. So I would really be excited if you ever got to come someday. This next gift that I want to show you is from Look at this card. This is so cute. This is three-dimensional, and this is three-dimensional. I love that little island sitting out there in the middle of the water. That's a cool card. This is from Jessica O'Brien. I also hear from her just about every day on my channel. Have a wonderful Christmas and a Happy New Year. Love, Jessica O'Brien. P.S. Sorry this may or may not arrive a couple of days late. That's okay. I didn't, I didn't get to the post office to pick up my mail for quite a few days. So it, everything was late. <laughs> not because you guys was late, but because I was late. Dear Grandma Shirley, I hope the holidays and New Year bring you lots of joy good health, and fun adventures. This card comes with a bookmark. And, and I want to say, Jessica... All right, this side is smooth and blank like a lot of uh, necklaces and bookmarks are. And this side is, looks like, I wish there wasn't always light shining on everything. <sighs> anyway, I don't know what it is supposed to be. It's insane that that won't show up on my camera. Nothing does. It always has lights from my lamps shining in it. Hey, maybe if I... I don't know. Anyway, I appreciate the bookmark. And I appreciate the card. I hope the holidays and New Year bring you lots of joy, good health, and fun adventures. This card comes with a bookmark. The card reminds me of some of the beautiful coast areas in Skyrim. Yes, it does. It reminds me of one in particular, right right past those, uh, those uh, stones that one's for thief, one's for warrior, and one's for magic. And you go right down past it, and there's the water out there, and there's an island out there. I hope, well, where am I? I thought something magical to hold your pens might be fun since you do so much writing. Looking forward, as always, to your new stories and videos. Okay, this, oh gosh, I love that card. This is what she sent me.
Isn't he cool? And I can put pins in here and have it sitting on my desk, which I shall do this morning. Thank you so much, Jessica. I appreciate it a lot. I better sit that over there on your card or I will forget. And I got another dragon. Dear Grandma Shirley, she wrote that at the top, and then the verse is there. Hope, they're filled with the beauty of the season, the warmth of family and friends, and the magic of a wonderful day. And then she writes, Merry Christmas and Happy New Year, with love from Shelley and Chris and Gareth and Donna. Donna or Dora or Una? and Amir O'Brien. I'll be so glad when you guys come back to visit me again. And Gareth, I hope you come this time. You missed the last time. Okay, I'm gonna put that down. And I shall read her letter. She put a picture on the bottom of the letter. There they all are. This one's Gareth. There's my friends. There's two of the daughters. <laughs> Thank you for putting that on there. Hi, Grandma Shirley. Merry Christmas and Happy New Year. The only thing that I am late for is mailing passage packages. <laughs> But you are in good company because you and Marcy are getting your stuff mailed out on the same day. <laughs> I have no clue where December went. I never know where any month goes. It just goes faster and faster. It all went by so fast, but it was very beautiful and we managed to spend lots of time together as a family. That's great. This is all of us at the Jiva Theater in Rochester, New York. We went to see Charles Dickens' A Christmas Carol. We had a blast. Oh, I bet that was fun. I love looking at your picture. I am really enjoying Cooper and his adventure in Hafinger Hole. I'm also just enjoying your vlogs and keeping us current on your life. Seeing you happy just makes my day. I am finding the horror game tests to be very funny. I will be getting annoyed or lost or bored and you will come right out and say how you are feeling and it is spot on to what I was feeling. <laughs> so. They're just so, they're just so dumb and boring. <laughs> really fun to watch, even though it is frustrating to you. Some of these games are just not fun or interesting. You got that right. <laughs> and why can't you interact with the stuff around you? I don't know. That's what makes it so boring. Anyway, you are, you are fun and amazing to watch. Inside this package are some goodies and a couple of things I found while out and about that I thought you would love. Gareth and Chris say hi and ask me to wish you all the best for the year to come. Thank you. Thank you for sharing and gaming. You make my days better. Stay well and take care. All my love, your grandkid, Shelly O'Brien. Thank you, Shelly. I gotta go back and look at that picture again.
thank you for putting that picture on there for me to have and to keep. And now, I'm going to show you the best thing she sent me last. Because you don't show the best thing first. She sent me some chocolate candy. Hearts, or it's, no, they're all stars. Stars say hearts and stars, but they're all stars. Some more chocolate. And here's some more chocolate. It's a it's a chocolate on a on a sucker stick. And it's dark chocolate. Thank you. And this I under I understand what the glass is, but and and I think this is wings. But is this a dragon head with a dragon point up here on its head? I can't tell. But I'm assuming that's what it is. So it should go back there on one of my shelves. And this is the other thing she sent me. Look at this. Look at this cool dragon. And his, ta his tail is just, and it's over here touching his other wing. This is so cool. <laughs> he's going to be over there on my shelf. Very, oh, he's so cute sitting there. Thank you very much. And then I got this package. Look how, see how skinny it is? And I knew as soon as I saw the package what was in it. Here's, here's the pretty gift container. You can guess what's in it, I'll bet. Chocolate. And this chocolate is, has chili peppers in it. Those are so good. And here's the letter. Ow, I bumped my elbow. Oh, this is from Izzy. Thank you, Izzy. Merry Christmas, Grandma. As per usual, I write this on my computer so that it will be easier for you to read than my absolutely horrible handwriting that I'm the owner of. <laughs> I just wanted to thank you for another year of so much fun. I do love all the Skyrim, the random and occasional other game, but I admit my favorite by far this year has been when you read your book chapters. I absolutely loved it, and it is the absolute highlight of my week. Well, thank you so much. You know, all the years that I've been writing and writing and writing and never finishing anything, once I decided to do it online so that you could all listen to me read it as I write it, I, I have managed to be able to finish a book and that makes me happy. <laughs> I always need to do it a quiet moment to just listen and perhaps have a cup of tea in the morning. <laughs> I hope you have a wonderful Christmas celebration and I hope you like this year's homemade card. This year's homemade card and the little chocolate I put with it. It is one of the few dark chocolates that I like, so I hope that 
you enjoyed as well. Again, thank you for all the entertainment that you provide us with every year, and I can't wait for more book readings. Thank you. Best wishes and hugs from Izzy, a.k.a. Hild. Izzy, you said this year's homemade card. This container for this chocolate. You made this? I think it is beautiful. And I'm going to keep this. Isn't, isn't, isn't that sweet? Thank you so much, Izzy. I love everything about this. Even, even the back of it is cool and she put her name on there. I am going to enjoy this. I'm going to use it by putting things in it. I won't be able to have it out and about a lot. I'll put something in it and set it on a shelf because the, the glitter comes off stuff and it is everything that I got that has glitter on it came and, uh, and, uh, the glitter has gotten all over my house. It always does. It takes years to ever get rid of all of it. And you said, and you said, the little, the little chocolate that I put with it, that's a big, wonderful chocolate bar. It's not little. <laughs> Thank you so much, Izzy. You do tend to underestimate things, don't you? Uh, well, let me see what else I can do. You wouldn't, you wouldn't believe all this stack of cards. Right, let's see what's this one. Oh, this one has something in it besides a card. Rowan and Mimi. Rowan and Mimi, I don't know who you are, but you're one of my viewers, and I appreciate. Look at what they, and, and this is another brand. Lint was Izzy's Chocolate. That's one of my favorite brands. This is my other favorite brand. This is... I'd never pronounce it right, Ghirardelli. Thank you so much. This is, this is a milk chocolate, but it's filled with chocolate. Runny chocolate. Oh, I can hardly wait to get into that. Which I shouldn't. That's just the card. Dear Grandma, my name is Rowan. Several months ago, I introduced my grandmother to your YouTube channel. I am trying to teach her how to play some video games. We really enjoy your vlogs. They encourage us. You're never too old to learn new things. Have a Merry Christmas. Your newest grandchildren, Rowan and Mimi. Well, thank you. Your newest grandchildren. I like that. Oh, I do want to say something about what you said. Uh, you're never too old to learn new things. So many people uh, comment to me and... Uh, Actually, some of them say things like they think that I just started gaming, and I didn't. I've been gaming for years and years and years, and uh, so I wasn't this old when I started gaming. Um, if it, right now I'm 87, I'll very soon be 88, but 
if I started trying to learn how to game right now, I couldn't. Not at all. I, I learned years and years ago. So if anyone's trying to teach their grandmother how to play games, you're going to have to be very easy with them and help them a lot. Um, it isn't easy for an older person to remember mainly all the different controls. And now, even though I've been playing for years and years and years, there's been a couple of new games come on uh, um, My brain is going so bad. Where I buy all my games at. Anyway. The new games that are coming out. The newer and newer games. Keep having more and more controls. And I saw one recently that I wanted to start playing a lot and I bought it oh and the prices have gone up so badly this stupid game was 60 some dollars and I bought it I thought now that's a style of game that I love I can't play it it has so many different I wrote the controls down line after line double row on the page and then I had to start on another page writing down controls I'd never remember all that I would be I would have to be playing a game and just about every move I'd make I'd have to look at that sheet of paper and I'm not going to play a game like that that's not fun I like to get lost in a game and become the character and be acting out a story in the game. You can't do that if you're having to look at the controls every time you move, which I would have to at my age. So I guess I'm not going to get to play new games. That's what I've been finding out. I've just, I've just gotten too old to start playing new ones. But the ones that I do play, like Skyrim, I've been playing that for so many years. I didn't just start playing. So uh, You can encourage your grandparents, but uh, don't be too insistent with them, because if they can't learn, they can't learn. Uh, if they're a younger grandparent than somebody my age now, sure. But at my age, it's hard to learn new games. So just be careful with them. Anyway, thank you, Rowan and Mimi, for my card and for my new... I can't wait to get into this candy bar. Thank you. Now I can start reading all these cards. <laughs> Oh, this is another one of those you can open out and it's 3D. Let me read it. Oh, nice. Dear Shirley, this year I thought I'd be nice. <laughs> so I chose a card that doesn't sprinkle glitter everywhere. Thank you so much. I liked the card's design and I hope you will too. So... We have gone through another year. You, me, and all your other viewers watching you read it. Hi, guys. <laughs> For me, it hasn't been a great year. But all bad things lead to something good, too. So, or so I believe. Well, that's a good way to think about it. For one, I've decided to take up studies after work. Good. I wish to study theology, so wish me luck. I do. I hope I am accepted. Wonderful. 
I do my own studies through the Bible over and over and different kinds of studies uh, throughout the years. Uh, but that might really be interesting to, to go to a theology school. Speaking of new things, do you remember that last Christmas I challenged you to do something new? Oh, yeah, yes, I remember this. <laughs> you said you wanted a mohawk. I love that. Even if you won't actually do it. I won't actually do it, but I'd like to. That mohawk wig that you put on in one of your vlogs was super cool and memorable. <laughs> and you finished the first Dorkly story. It was a great pleasure to listen to it. Thank you. I'm still enjoying Phantom of the Woods, and I look forward to the Dorkly sequel. Thank you so much. I've taken so many notes and made so many different outlines and stuff getting ready to write Dorkly sequel. So I'll be starting that one of these days. I'm not going to forget it. Another thing this year, you moved. I hope you are cozy and well settled. It's been years since my last move, but I find it rather stressful. <laughs> it is stressful. And I am all nice and settled in and everything's put away. Now I spend half my time in here. <laughs> I have a computer room now and the other half of my time writing and reading. So I'm running out of space on the card. Sorry for the delay. I posted it late. That's fine, because I was late getting it out of the library or post office. A Merry Christmas to you and a Happy New Year, Gamer Gemma. Thank you so much, Gemma. And guys, this is the front of the card. This is the 3D part. Isn't that cute? Thank you so much, Gemma. And, and leave me comments once in a while uh, telling me anything you'd like to tell me about while you're in, uh, in theology school. I'd like to, uh, to know either how, how they teach you, how you, how you learn that in the school situation. You can email me and then just write as much as you want. I'd like that. Oh, oh I'm going to get this all over my keyboard. Oh, it's just got glitter all over it. And it's getting all over my pants. <laughs> now it's going to be all over my floor. And it's going to be tracked all over my house. And it's going to be there for years. That's what happened to me once before. Dear Shirley, with warm thanks for all of your terrific content, Always wonderful to see you setting an example for all us senior gamers. You're a senior gamer. Cool. Have a wonderful Christmas. Best regards. Ruth Ellen. So sorry for the glitter. <laughs> if you're sorry for the glitter, then you shouldn't have sent it. There's all kinds of pretty cards out there without glitter. Hey, but thank you so much for sending me a card. Sorry I gripe and complain, but 
Oh, how I hate this stuff. That, that, uh, two, three years ago, four years ago, I think, I got a card and that glitter stayed in my carpeting and floors and furniture and clothes and for the rest of the years that I lived there in that apartment until I moved. Because you can vacuum and vacuum and vacuum and it doesn't suck it up. This is a pretty card, and it also has glitter all over it. P.S. I know that you aren't a fan of snow, but I hope you like this cute card. I do like the cute card, and, and yeah, I don't like to be out in the snow. Merry Christmas, Grandma Shirley. I hope you are doing well. I'm excited for more Skyrim adventures, and I can't wait to see more of your videos. I'll talk to you in the comments soon, I'm sure. Stay warm. Hey, it's Charlie. <laughs> I know, hey, it's Charlie. Thank you so much. And I'm glad you signed it that way, otherwise I wouldn't have known it was you. That's a pretty card without the glitter. Thank you very much, Charlie. Oh, look at the Santa Claus with the little deer. Isn't that sweet? Merry Christmas and Happy New Year, Grandma. I hope you have an amazing holiday season. Love your grandkids, Stephanie Pulling. Thank you very much, Stephanie. Thank you for a smooth card. <laughs> that's such a cute picture that's on there. And thank you for your holiday wishes. I appreciate it. It's a pretty card. I love pretty cards. To, to Jarl, surely. Have an amazing holiday and a happy new year. Stay safe. I hope 2024 will be a good year. I love all your videos. I can't wait. See what you have. For us. Love Angelica Galdos. Is it G A? I don't know if that's. I don't know what that last name is because some of the some of the letters aren't finished, so I'm not sure of which letter they're supposed to be, and uh, I think a couple of them are almost together and I don't know if it's two or one. I don't know. I can't read it. Sorry. But thank you very much for the card. Thank you for the sentiment in it and I appreciate it very much. And then this, this is a big one.
Oh, this is cool. Look at this. Isn't, isn't that cool? Hi, Grandma, and a very happy new year, too. I just wanted to thank you for another wonderful year's videos. You truly are a dear and special lady, and your videos are so much fun for all of your grandkids. I hope you have a wonderful holiday. Much love and best wishes, Christine Thompson. Well, thank you so much, Christine. Thank you very much. And I love that card. Thank you. That's it. Thank you all very much. I appreciate the cards. I appreciate the gifts. I love my little dragons. I love my candy. So thank you all very much. And I hope you all had a nice Christmas and New Year's. And uh, let me see. There was something that I wanted to talk to you about for just a minute. Oh, oh. <clears throat> I get so many questions about what mods do I have and, and other things in regards to things on my channel. Well, every gamer that I have ever watched does the same thing that I do. And when I read any of their comments, I don't see them asked things like that because people watching them, just like me watching them, I know to look under their videos and because they have the lists of what they've put under there. They show all of their mods and they show other uh, links to other things that you can watch. And I do the same thing. And yet people are always asking me, what mods do you use and what, what uh, else do you play or something like that. And uh, and so they're under my videos just like everybody else's is. So I don't know what else to tell you. So thank you all for all of the uh, gifts and the cards that you sent. And I appreciate it very much. So I hope you enjoyed this and, and seeing everything. And I will talk to you again next time. And for now, goodbye. See ya.